Good morning, I'm Carnival Ben and we've just arrived at Western Car Park where all the carnival carts are parked up. Um, we've got some bulbs to replace. We've had a bit of rain over the past few days and I think that's taken out some of the bulbs. We need to replace them. Um, I'm going to extend uh, the neutral cable. Um, if you've seen my Burnham video you'll have seen me changing the plug and socket on that. And we're going to do some general tidy up work just to neaten up around the bottom of the, the main trailer. The first job that we need to do though is to connect up uh, the main cables as they are now just so that we can switch everything on and see which bulbs need replacing. So now that the main cables are connected I can start up the generator so we can switch on some bulbs and see which ones need replacing. Now to power up the generator, first thing you need to do is switch on the isolator which disconnects the main battery when it's not in use. We switch this off between carnivals so it doesn't run the battery down. So let's switch that on first. Next we need to start the engine, which is this switch here. And then finally we need to switch the main circuit breaker on. And that sends the power down through these main cables to all the distribution boards. So we're going to start off checking the roof trim which is already on on this one. So we got Mike and Johnny just adding a few bits to the side of the bottom of the main trailer just to hide the wheels a little bit. We ran out of time in the shed to do this so we're just gonna have a, have a go now to add a few bits on make it look a bit more respectable. Yes. I think we've got to do a western car park is get some fuel put in the generator we used a bit since uh, since Bridgewater so we're gonna get it topped up today. So this is the cable that I'm going to use to extend the neutral cable. Um, I'm going to chop it in half here so we've got two pieces because uh, I'm going to extend one of the other cables as well just to be safe. So first thing I'm going to do is cut the cable just there and I'm going to do that with a grinder. So I've now got my two pieces of cable um, to be able to extend them and use them on, on the cart to extend the wires I need to put some ends on here and I'm going to use these crimp lugs um, which basically get crimped onto the end of the cable onto there like that and then I can use this hole to put a bolt through it and bolt it onto something. So next job then is to crimp these onto the end. So to crimp the ends on, I need to trim back some of this insulation. Draw about there.
So there we go, there's the bare ends of copper coming out of the cable. This now fits on over the top of here. Like so, and then I need to crimp this here and squeeze it all together. And to do that, I use a hydraulic crimping tool, which basically squeezes the cable between these two jaws. And there we go, that's held on there now, nice and securely. So I'll just wrap some tape around just to protect it a little bit. And that's that end done. Then I've just got to do the other three. So now that I've got the, the extension cables made up, I'm going to connect them into the generator to extend these wires that are a bit too short. So as you can see I've bolted the crimp lugs through and the cables are now joined together. I just now need to wrap some tape around it to insulate the joint. And there we go, I can now pull this through down the side of the generator and we'll have a lot more slack at the other end. Seven. 
Okay. Yeah, all oh, good. into the car park now we're going to split down here before we get back onto the road Okay, so we're now all hitched up and just make the final few connections and we'll be off. So we've left Western Car Park, we're all split down, back on the road again on our way to Petherton. On the way we're going to get the cart weighed uh, just before we get into Petherton. Um, once the cart's weighed we can go, get on through onto the lineup. Um, looks like we're going to be one of the last carts on the lineup as we, we were up near the back at Weston and we were one of the last to come out of the car park so unfortunately it's at the back again not much we can do about that though anyway we're on the road on our way to Petherton So here we are at the Way Bridge. Just going to get the cart weighed. So we've got to the Way Bridge. We've weighed the cart. Uh, but we seem to have a problem with the lorry now. Um, seems to be a problem with the fuel system. We're just having a look. We're taking bits of it apart so that we can get to the engine. Uh, and we're trying to work out what the problem is. Not sure how long it's going to take us to fix this. Uh, going to see what we can do. Now approach 
reaching the end of the lineup, a bit later than expected. It's about three o'clock in the morning. When we get to the end, we've got to do a U-turn and join the rest of the carts on the other side of the road. Hitch up and then we're done for tonight. So we're now right at the end of the lineup, just hitching our units back together. And once that's done, we'll pull forward into position and then that's us done for tonight. Not far off. A foot, a foot. Go on, go on, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're going there. So there we go, we've pulled up into position and we're done for tonight. So once again everybody, thanks for watching and I'll see you again on the next video.